Hello Mzansi and welcome to Mzansi. History was made when Mrs. Zulu was crowned as the new king of the Zulu people. The last coronation in the Zulu nation was in December 1971 when his late father King Godwo Zulitini ascended the throne. King Mrs. Zulu expressed his gratitude to Ntlungu Logamafu as she was the only mother who came to support him. This is King Zulitini's sixth wife, King Zola Mafu. Praises were pouring in for Queen Zola who attended the king's coronation ceremony out of the five remaining queens since his third wife was laid to rest in 2021. People on Twitter were praising the queen saying the greatest queen the mother of all nations indeed you showed us today that your husband's children are your children you've earned more respect to the south african dr tandega mazibuko has revealed that the queen had a deep relationship according to her zola was abducted in 2003 allegedly by queen mswati's sister the late queen allegedly swiftly kidnapped queen zola at a tender age of 17 at her father's farm just after swaziland's well-known reed dance according to reports at some point that queen zola was whisked away from her home at 17 it plunged into scandal she was reportedly incarcerated in a palace for a decade when the teenage Zola appeared in public with the king in 2004 it scandalized the public it is alleged that the queen was behind the abduction queen Zola is the sixth wife and she got married to king Godwin Zolitini at the age of 27 after being kept in the palace for 10 years they had a 40 year age difference the royal family considers it a privilege for them to choose you to be the wife of the king and usually you cannot refuse this is what feeds the culture of forced marriages in Africa this was done against her and her parents will in 2003 and in 2004 the king showed up with this young girl who had been kept inside his household so basically queen zola is swati and so was king mrs zulu's mother she was the queen's beloved sister above all she was brought raised and taught zulu culture by mrs zulu's mother she has no choice but to be on mrs zulu's side